Hey there, so today we're going to talk about uh, video games and Criterions. And we're going to do that right after I uh, get out of my comfy jammies and just uh, dress up a little bit. So here I have my Green Lantern hoodie. It's my favorite. I got a Montreal Comic Con last year. I actually went, it was the last thing that I bought there at the uh, time. And uh, random females come up and hug me when I, uh, when I wear this thing. I guess it just looks comfy. Anyway. There's the whole hub blue still going on. It's, a, it's November 15th and 22nd. Come closer and closer. Uh, the division and the camps argue more and more. Should, should we get the PS4? Should we get the Xbox One? This Xbox One is better. PS4 is better. And there's like a little camp in the background talking about but us PCs, well, right now nobody cares. Uh, and that's the truth. And you, um, if you're a PC gamer, that's great. But it's not something that, as a console gamer, and maybe I just don't get the PC uh, gaming mentality. I, there's nothing about PC gaming that excites me. Uh, get it, the, con the new consoles coming out, the game releases, seems like more of an event uh, for the console. Then, you know, if you're a PC gamer, that's great. I've got a lot of friends that I would swear by uh, PC gaming. And they start graphics and sound cards and all this crap I don't care about. I just uh, want games I like to play. And as everybody knows, until about a few weeks ago, I was going to be picking up a PS4 on launch. And still, I think the PS4 was probably the better system out of, out of two of them. But at the end of the day, I'm going to have them all. Uh, inshallah, I will be having a, I will, I will pick up the, uh, I'm getting the Wii U soon, I'll be picking up the PS4, I will be picking up the Xbox One, and why? Because each one delivers something that I want. I want my Nintendo games, I want to play my Mario, my Donkey Kong, my Zeldas, I want to have my handheld that I can play Pokemon on. I'm a gamer, and, uh, I enjoy it, it. I may not game as much as I used to when I was younger. Of course, I want to get a retro system for upstairs. Uh, up in our uh, our bedroom upstairs, right now we've got like a, one of the old style analog TVs. We've got a VCR, a bunch of VHS tapes, and uh, I kind of want to retro the room. So uh, we're going to be like uh, painting it. I'm going to be putting up some of those uh, tin uh, signs that you see with like uh, Super Friends and Fantastic Four, old school stuff on there. And uh, hoping to get a uh, retro gaming system, and a uh, and, and, and probably a phonograph, a uh, record player, and uh, just a small one that I can play some of my records I've gotten on. I've got the 2001 Space Odyssey soundtrack on on record, and I've never been able to listen to it. Uh, but I keep looking around, hoping I'm going to find something. I'd also like to have a laser disc player for downstairs. Uh, I'm a cinephile, and I want to enjoy movies and as many movies in, in as many formats in as many styles as I can, and uh, can ostensibly afford. Unfortunately, around here, there are zero Laserdisc players, and uh, I keep looking. I put things on Kijiji in hopes that one day someone's going to contact me, and I'll better get one. Uh, I don't, don't even mention eBay, because it's way, way, way too expensive. But uh, all that being said, let's get back to the consoles now. Whether you want the PS4 or Xbox One, it really should come down to your, prefer to your preference of uh, games. Because let's face it, yes, the PS4 may work a lot uh, graphically and a lot faster, whatever, than the Xbox One does right now. But at the end of the day, most gaming companies are not going to go that extra mile to make the game better on the PS4 than it is on the Xbox One. What they're going to do is they're going to make it as good as it needs to be for both systems. So what you're going to see is a lot of people not being as blown away graphically well being blown away compared to now but not as much as the dot might be uh, now PS4 exclusives they're going to look pretty damn good same with the Xbox exclusives I'm guessing that they're going to put more work into those like in house so uh, you will see more uh, of a change and, and a difference out there uh, things like I don't know Next great example but uh i'm sure onward going drive club stuff like that they're gonna be like really kind of trying to push the limits uh, graphically and uh and processor wise now uh for me 
I like games, gaming systems for the games. I played Uncharted and Infamous, and uh, heck, I even played uh, The Resistance Fall of Man, and I thought it was way underrated uh, as a game trilogy. Now, I had fun with them, so, uh, although I had the Xbox 360 and the PlayStation 3, uh, the PlayStation 3 was my console of choice. I did have a Wii as well, by the way, and, uh, but I mostly played the PS3. Uh, the Wii was used for mostly uh, sports games and kind of the again the franchise games, but uh, there are still some cool stuff there. I uh, still have my PS3. It's a white uh, 500 gig slim with the free year of PlayStation Plus, and uh, the threw in a PlayStation All Star something or another, some kind of fighting game. It's kind of like Super Smash Brothers. We didn't really get into it. Uh, no, I do like Super Smash Brothers. Uh, that's one of the things I want the Wii U for. I want to play Super Smash Brothers. I want to play Mario Kart. The Wii U just has a really good system that people are underrating right now. Uh, but I think the Nintendo system should be in everybody's home anyway. Uh, especially if you got if you have kids or you, if you game with friends and stuff like that. Yeah, it's it's more fun that way. It's a more social gaming system. Let's say a PS3 or an Xbox 360. There's a difference between going online and like talking to your friend from like umpteen thousand or just up the road for some reason. Remember back in the day when you all get together and you're like, oh, dude, I'm totally, we're totally getting together. We're gonna play Call of Duty, whatever, on the on the on the PS2, and uh, everybody would get together and they get their controllers. Sometimes you get like LAN parties together where you get like two or three TVs and you get your uh, your systems. You hook them up. Uh, and you can you play, you can have some fun. Uh, now with the social aspect, is really <sighs> trolling other people on on a gaming console is pretty much the lowest form of trolling that you can do. If you've ever done it, that's really fucking lame. Uh, don't. Just that's stupid. Or a friend of mine. Well, I consider him a friend on here. Is a really good YouTuber actually, and uh, he did a video once where he basically had to take in his PS3. I think he got rid of his PS3. Because, and I think it's Walking Dead Dexter, if I'm wrong, you can, you can tell me, but uh, because his kids were being bothered by trolls on, uh, on the PS3 while they were playing like, games like Little Big Planet and stuff like that, which utterly disgusts me. But honestly, uh, when it comes to like, uh, when it comes to internet trolling, uh, did you ever see uh, Jay and Silent Bob Strike Back at the ending? That would, if I had the money, that would be me. Because, uh, I don't dig that stuff. Now, systems, go for what you like. I want them all. Why uh, PS4? Because PlayStation 3 was my system of choice last generation. And I know there's some stuff going to be coming out there that I want. Xbox One, because Titanfall. Halo. Uh, yeah, Halo may seem a little long in the tooth to some people, but you know what? I still enjoy playing games like that. And uh, they're games that I have fun with. So, whether, even if, though it may not be the system of this generation, you know, it'll still be, uh, hopefully, in my, uh, by next year sometime, being in there with the, uh, when I put the PlayStation 4 in there. And I'm probably going to grab them both around the same time. Uh, right now, I'm just focusing on getting my uh, stuff for my kids for Christmas. Uh, grabbing them, uh, hopefully, the Wii U. And if a uh, Boxing Day comes and I can find a good deal on a 3DS or a 3DS XL, then uh, maybe I'll go and I'll grab one of those. <clears throat> That's my take on gaming. Uh, as for, like, PC gaming, it's too expensive. Uh, it doesn't really interest me. And my PCs are used basically for uh, doing videos, watching videos, and watching television on. I don't watch uh, the internet. I don't watch TV anymore on the, like this. And, uh... We have cell phones. She has the iPhone, and I've got the Galaxy S3, so we're like a competing yeah, com against companies. And uh, we both have iPads. She has an iPad Mini, and I've got the iPad 2, and I want to upgrade to the Mini. But, uh, this is kind of a ramble video, isn't it? But it's what I wanted to talk about. I wanted to talk about what you guys... And again, this is Adium on there. Really haven't got much talking on this one, and I'm very disappointed actually that uh, nobody's really uh, 
gave any sort of big response to this. But I've been excited about the Criterion sale going on at Barnes & Noble right now. It's 50% off Criterions. And uh, they got some cool stuff. TJ actually showed his uh, TJ Pyramid. We used to subscribe that guy, by the way, I guess. Uh, and his uh, lovely wife, uh, who just had her birthday recently. Uh, now the Creepy Monster Squad. Now, he did a video about this Criterion, so which, is, which is great. And he said something that I, I have to disagree with. He said Criterion's don't usually have features, good features. Dude, you are picking the wrong Criterions, because Criterions are known for starting, being the ones that started having features, and uh, there are some amazing Criterions. Actually, I'm going to shoot a video, actually, uh, about Criterion afterwards, I think, and we're going to talk more about it. And hopefully that'll get somebody to talk about it here, because... Guys, if you're watching my videos, uh, please subscribe if you haven't. Please give a thumbs up. And if you want to, now that people are doing it, I know that I'm doing it for our videos that I like, I'm sharing them on Google+. So I'm trying to get you guys more subs subscribers and more viewers, uh, more friends. Uh, please do the same. If you like my video, hit the share button. Share it on Google+. Uh, so people that may not have seen my video uh, will get a chance to, uh, to see it and maybe hopefully subscribe and uh, someone else I can talk to just argue and debate and trade stuff with and uh and when the contest next contest comes up well you'll be in and you'll be eligible we've already got one person that's eligible for two uh, uh part places in the contest i did not forget i never forget now i am going to go and call my uh, parents because it's been a while and you got to keep up with the family units right Again, like, share, and respond. Give me a video response on the criteria. Tell me what you want to get in the Barnes Noble sale. Tell me what you're going to get. Tell me what you got. Show me your criterion sets. Show me what you've got and show me why. Tell me why you got it. Maybe there's something that you got that I don't have that I want to get. It makes it easier. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. I This has gotten really cold again because I the video went on longer than I expected, so i got to reball the kettle, get a new... Tea, tea bag and well it's time for tea